Pimp. Pimp my, my crutches. crutches. <laughs> you know that pimp my ride? Right, pimp my crutches. <laughs> That's your crutches story. Oh gosh, I mean, I've been using crutches since I was 17. I decided I wanted to get a decent pair. So I spent lots of money trying to find a, a pair that works for me and looks nice. And um, I spent quite a bit of money and still haven't been able to find a pair that works for me. So um, what I decided that I was going to do, I just got a new pair actually from Physio, an ergonomic pair, because mm. I started to find I'm having a lot more problems with my hands and my wrists, and it's affecting my, my shoulders more when I have to use them. The constant yeah. stepping and walking. Yeah. yeah. So, um, so I've now got an ergonomic pair. So what I've decided, so they're grey and silver and they look very horrible and NHSE. So I've got a friend who's a tailor, so I've decided that I'm going to get her to paint my crutches. <laughs> <laughs> Pimp, pimp my, my crutches. crutches. <laughs> you know that pimp my ride? Right, pimp my crutches. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Because crutches can get used. <laughs> 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 pimp my crutches. <laughs> you are so wrong, Marcia. <laughs> my walking aids. Okay? Does that sound better? <laughs> right, yeah. So your walking aid. Yes. Walking aid. I'm going walking to get aid. them pimped. Okay. <laughs> so that when I have to use Your them, crutches. they can still look a little bit nice. Yeah, no, because you no, know, it is. That's why I used to use an umbrella. Mm. So, so it doesn't look like a walking aid, doesn't look like a walking stick. Use the umbrella, yeah. and nobody really asks too much about that. Yeah. So, yeah. I just haven't got the energy or I'm just in too much pain so that's when I'll have to spend extra money then ordering a takeaway. Little things that I guess the average person wouldn't need to Doesn't think, think about, yeah. yeah. And then I hold on to the shopping trolley because I don't need to use a crutch to walk around. Yeah. And you know, like, obviously people look at you when you park in the blue badge. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah. But, but you're walking. But yeah. That's today. Yeah. Exactly. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't look like there's anything wrong with you. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. So you're already judged, and I had mm -hmm. years and years and years of being judged by my appearance. Mm -hmm. I was in a wheelchair for a little while, mm -hmm. and I couldn't see out my left eye. And just how people communicate with you in a wheelchair to walking on with crutches, a whole different Did level. I can imagine. Yeah. Like. I felt really patronised. I felt mm -hmm. like, why are you talking to me like you mm -hmm. can come down? Mm -hmm. And I'm really conscious of like, to, when I'm supporting disabled adults, mm -hmm. I'm really conscious of just talk to them like normal, no more, innit? Exactly. It's, it, people automatically really do this mm. patronising, and they're not meaning to. No. I don't, I don't they think probably they're probably just don't even know what to say, say yeah. or how to deal with it. I don't like people having to talk to me like that. Or, yeah. Like, or the pity. I, yeah. Stuff. It's, it's not about pity, it's just, <sighs> it just is what it is, isn't it? Now coming out a lot more, talking about the illnesses and talking about how you feel and stuff like that. Just to hide it all the time. Yeah. For the health. No one knew, yeah. no one knew when I was ill, no one knew if I was having treatment, no mm -hmm. one knew anything. But now I'm just like, it is what it is, man. Mm -hmm. Because I can look normal on, on most days. I don't like to not look normal. That's right. On yeah. Most days. Yeah. So I, I I I still struggle. I was with my aunt and my cousin. My aunt and my cousin know and care and I still didn't want to use the crutches. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do whatever I can not to <laughs> use the crutches. I see <laughs> like you know that like what's it called? No no os no the um for occupational Occupation, therapy. Yeah. So she did come with me and was walking around, she goes, Oh, you walk in a protective manner. I was like, huh? Eh? And I would purposely, didn't realise, but mm. she showed me I was purposely walking next to things mm -hmm. so I can yeah. lean a little bit if you need to. Yeah. 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 So I was like, oh, is that what you've noticed mm -hmm. what I'm doing? That's mm -hmm. the word for it. So I will do things, I'm not too far from the car. Mm -hmm. but if we're going to the shop, I'm clocking what I can lean on mm. real quick. So I was like, oh, okay, there's a word for it. Okay, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, it's, it's, 
It's strange, isn't it? You, you, you learn how to do these things out of necessity. Because I used to fall down a lot. Right, yeah. Blatantly smash the hips to the ground, mm. trip. Or, yeah. I'd like to see how you pimp your crutches. <laughs> <laughs> I will show you what they've done. <laughs> I mean, I've been using crutches since I was 17. Um, and for years and years and years. <laughs> what are you busting up? I ain't even said nothing yet. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> since you were 17. <laughs> 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 I've been to use the crutches and stuff, and I've been having to use them since I was 17. So for years and years, I was just using the old NHS grey and silver ones that mm. just look horrid. So a couple of years ago, I said, right, you know, I finally accepted that this is my life, innit? <laughs> I'm not pausing it, I'm not pausing it. Um... No, the, then I got horrid crutches in it. <laughs> Great crutches. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. yeah but...